Hi, I'm James, and in this video I'm taking a look at Project Cars 2 running on Intel HD620 graphics with the Core i5-8250U processor. As you can see here, we're running the game at 1366 by 768 and I have minimised all the detail settings except for the texture filtering there. Um, the game did default to way higher than this, and I had to pull it down because it was sort of single figure um, frame rates out of the box. And we've loaded up some pretty quick uh, LMP cars here and the Nürburgring racetrack and we can see frame rates are generally sort of 20-25 frames per second up to around 30 frames per second. Uh, this is one of the tougher tracks uh, and these are obviously some of the tough cars. I was struggling really to control these with the gamepad partly just I don't tend to play racing games with the gamepad I tend to play uh, steering wheel but also just with the frame rate, it's not the easiest to deal with sort of a quick car like this, and I was very quickly left behind uh, by the AI cars. I did also try dropping the detail down, uh, sorry, the resolution down to 720p, and this didn't really yield much benefit. Um, it may have given a one or two frame per second increase, but very little. You could potentially start dropping it down towards 800 by 600, which will reduce the pixels quite a lot. Um, but I think you're still going to not be getting huge frame rates on this and you're going to have a huge impact on their visual fidelity. I did also, however, then fire up a Ginetta G40 race at uh, Laguna Seca and as we'll switch over to that in a moment. And we can see here the uh, the simpler track and having all the same cars does improve frame rates a little bit so we are seeing generally over 30 frames per second or certainly close to it during this test uh, and just being in a less powerful car it was a lot easier to control i was able to switch off some of the assists and felt really more like i was driving the car than just hanging on to it so if you want to give project cars a go on an intel uhd 620 equipped laptop it will work, it will run, um, you're not going to have the best experience with it, but with a bit of perseverance I'm sure you could get used to playing with the gamepad. Um, the frame rates are going to hamper you, um, just because it's not quite as responsive as you may want. But for the casual player, if you really want to give it a go, you can run it, it's just not going to be an ideal experience. I hope you found this video useful, um, do let us know what else you'd like to see us testing in the comments below and hit subscribe if you want to see our new videos as we post them.